Okay, so I'm guessing you saw Spoiler Monkey about five seconds ago, and really, he's quite relevant in this one because I'm going to talk about Wolverine. I realise I'm on a bit of a Hugh Jackman binge from the entirety of my life, uh, but I have a good reason for it. Hugh Jackman. My mate, let's call her Sam Winchester, um, and another mate of mine, Dean Winchester, and me. We went to go see a movie, but Dean Winchester couldn't come because she was giving birth to a rhinoceros. And we kind of ran in our horrible school uniforms, uh, jumpers, heavy school bags, laptop bags just flapping in the wind, and us just running from the bus stop to the cinema. Turns out you need an ID card to get into this movie. I tried to bluff my way through with my cunning and silver tongue, but no, that didn't work. Eventually we went in to see uh, Wolverine. Now when you go to the cinema, you've got to have an even amount of uh, popcorn and drink because otherwise, you know, it doesn't weigh out in your stomach because then you need to go to the loo. Like in the first 10 minutes, you've got too much drink and not enough popcorn. But if you've got too much popcorn, then you won't, then you like get really thirsty throughout the thing and you have to go buy a drink halfway through and you're just like, <laughs> your tongue is drying out in your mouth and you're like flipping across the like cinema chairs because you are so thirsty but you don't want to leave Hugh Jackman behind, so you got to have an even balance. My uh, friend, Sam and I, Sam Winchester, yeah, Sam Winchester, he, uh, she, <laughs> certainly not he, wow, she'd kill me if she heard that. She and I went in to see Wolverine. And I got some thoughts to share. It was a good movie. Really good movie. That's got nothing to do with the multiple Hugh Jackman topless scenes. Nothing at all, especially not when he's Cutting wood. Good scene. Good scene. Got a few points that really, really did my head in. As we know, if you've seen the trailer, then you, you know that he um he loses his magic. He opens his stomach with his animantium, animantium, animanium, and a claw, and pulls like a mite thing off his heart. Let me just say, that is disturbing. This guy is reaching inside himself to pull out this tiny little thing on his heart. And he does it blind. He can't see what he's doing halfway through because there's a giant fight scene going on around him. What the hell? You've got Hugh Jackman. I mean, Hugh Jackman lying topless on a table with his hand in his chest. Not sure how I feel about that. Probably okay. Another bit is when he gets impaled with a sword and he um pulls it out totally fine also when you see the gashes in his skin and there's like a hole where skin used to be that's completely normal not disturbing whatsoever but um he might want to get that checked <laughs> get rid of me unnamed orangutan okay you're gorgeous if I weren't in a loving relationship, I'd totally date you. Actually, no, I wouldn't you take cute for me to date? I've got standards. Okay, so I'll... Mm, in, mm. in Wolverine Origins, uh, his bone claws get... <sighs> no, no. No, I'm not okay with this. I'm not, okay. I'm not a doctor for a reason. I cannot even go into... Ugh, not pleasant. I don't like the idea of things... Nah, can't do it. In this movie, uh, happens again, but with animantium and a manium and a anna man -ium. Me and my mate were just sitting there, just like, kind of it. We were there in our, like, knee length school skirts, just tucked up under our knees and just slowly rocking back and forth as we drift into the distance. Like a leaf on the wind. And then, you know, he took his shirt off, so we were all fine again. No. I reckon I'd give it an 8 out of 10. Yeah, an 8 out of 10. Um, yeah, I reckon 8 out of 10. I mean, it's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Oh my god. If you are going to go see it and these spoilers haven't done anything for you because it's not really that spoilery, frankly. I mean, the fact that Wolverine dies is a bit of a spoiler, but <laughs> if you're fine with that, then go, go see it. Um, but the post-credits, 
holy shit. The post credits just... This is the face I make when Pi comes in the room. I need to name my orangutan, so if you've got any ideas, comment in that direction, because as far as I'm aware, it's in that direction. Hello, look at the... Oh, I'm psychedelic. So I got some bad news today, which kind of shook me a bit. My friend, who I thought I could trust, told me she didn't like pie. <laughs> I don't understand. How did someone not like pie? It doesn't make any sense. How can you like pie? I mean, it's pie, and if you don't like pie, then how are you, like, alive? Because she doesn't like it. She doesn't like any pie. She doesn't like meat pie. I don't send me pie because it's meat and everything, but... Apple pie? How don't you like apple pie? It's apple pie. Oh, so angry. Not so much angry as confused, disturbed, and shaking in the corner. Orangutan. 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 He's a little stoned, 